afternoon, the casket carrying the remains of the foreign politician and doctor, Stephen Oscar Malinga was carried into the chambers of parliament by high-ranking police officers. It was a somber moment in the August House as legislators received the body of Dr. Malinga, who is the fourth MP to die in the ninth parliament. The Deputy Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Bolanya, ministers and MPs laid rest on the casket, as is the norm whenever one of the colleagues passes on. The second Deputy Prime Minister, Moses Ali, moved a motion in which he hailed Dr. Malinga as a man who loved his country for leaving a good job in the United States to come and serve the nation. Dr. Malinga is a, a refined man, a very refined man. You not see in his face, you not see in his eyes, you know, antagonism. He's sober. He disagrees with you in a friendly way. But he will make sure you understand why he differs. We have missed a candid person. He's one person who would come out and tell the truth about Whatever situation, be it political, be it professional, be it technical. MPs ask the government to ensure that all health centers in the countryside are well equipped with medicines in direct reference to the inadequate facilities that the health center for in Palsa, where Dr. Malinga died, was in. Colleagues died from different causes of death, but the situation still remains the same in the sense that Institutions which should really uh, help save uh, for all that is humanly possible, a person can save the Lord. But as Ugandans, and I really put this to the front bench, we really need to win this battle. We lose far too many Ugandans through poor health services. Malinga is the fourth MP to die in the ninth parliament. The first was the Osu County MP Michael Oromaid, who was followed by the Vuteregioman MP Serena Nebanda. Just last month, the first Prime Minister and Minister for East African Affairs, Elia Kategaya, also passed on in Nairobi. Olanya asked MPs to pray hard that no more deaths occur of MPs. Malinga's junior minister, Musa Echero, described him as a man of skills who helped him understand and work with people faced with natural calamities in the Disaster Preparedness Ministry. I told Dr. Malinga to learn his brain. I told Dr. Malinga to learn his experience. And I accepted to donate to Dr. Malinga my energy so that he could prepare the ministry for us. Dr. Malinga was a former UPC diehard, defected to NRM and was appointed Minister of Health and later Minister for Disaster Preparedness, where he served up to his demise. Malinga, who died at the age of 68, joined the politics in 1996 as Vitebo County MP. May his soul rest in peace. Agnes Nandutu, NTV, Parliament.